Welcome to Ravens Over. Please subscribe to my channel. Also, if you have a story we cover, you can email me at ravenover over is O V A H at ravenover at yahoo.com. There's an Instagram button at the top. If you follow me, I'll follow you back. Let's go to the story. Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? How you doing? How you been? What's going on? What's good? Why you getting it in? Why you getting it in? What's going on, people? Go, go. Okay, I just got this email in from Instagram and stuff, and I want to share this with you as far as the policy that's going on, because I know a lot of things inside of the marketing that we live in. For some reason, they're doing a lot of things with our personal information. And I want to share this with you. And I want to get your feedback on how do you feel about Instagram when you post things online. Now, I learn a lot of things we've been putting up online that they're sharing of different things as far as our stuff. Now, please take a moment to review some changes to our terms and data policy. Let us know if you agree to them to continue using Instagram. Update to our terms and data policies. Your Instagram experience is changing and you still own your photos and videos. We are giving you a better way to access the data and understand how it is used. Instagram has been a part of Facebook since 2012 and making some corporate changes going forward. Our terms will reflect that Facebook Inc. is responsible for is responsible for Instagram, the Instagram app, and the way we process data are not changing. Our terms are now more clear about the, our terms are more clear about the service we provide and what we expect from every member of our community to keep Instagram a safe place for everyone. We are, here are some updates we want to make sure you know about. We update our intellectual property license, but your rights aren't changing. You still own your photos and videos. We update how we use information to show activities on Instagram so people can see when you interacted with an ad the same way we do in a particular post. We also have a new data policy that explains how data is collected, shared, and used in Facebook products, including Instagram, the policy address, newer features like stores, stories, direct messages, activity status, and the creativity tools of our cameras. We wanted to make sure you knew about this like information in the policy. We received different kinds of information from your device, like how you tap and stroll, which can be dis distinguish humans from bots and de detect frauds. We can use and share information for research, especially in ways that help us to keep our community safe on Instagram, like to understand and prevent bullying and harassment. The policy has more information about what we collect from your activities and your partner and our partners. Um, and our partners, how we continue information across Facebook companies and personalizing your experience, including ad, we provide ads without, we provide ads without telling advertisers who you are. The policy has more information about what we do share with your advertisers and partners, we never sell your data. Because the policy also covers Facebook, including information about facial recognition. We do not use facial recognition technology on Instagram. If we introduce it, we will let you know and give you a choice. Then they give you this thing as far as um, agree, um, read the full terms and stuff. You know, this is the thing. I find amazing. Um, Instagram has been a part of Facebook since 2012. Okay. I, 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 just, I heard about that already. They partnered together and stuff. So I guess you didn't know that Instagram is partnered with Facebook and stuff. They said, well, then I sell your data and stuff like that. They said, you still own your photos and your um, videos. We update um, intellectual 
um, property license, but your rights aren't changing. I guess property license basically, um, I guess in locations and stuff. So I guess when you shoot down outside and stuff, I, I'm, that, I'm assuming, I'm not sure. So if you have any feedback on this, please give your um, two cents into it. So I'm not saying I know everything. But whatever you can share, please share with me. And people that's going to be at the comments trying to understand everything. Uh, we also, we all, we can use and share information to research, especially in ways that help us keep our community safe. Instagram, like understand and prevent bullying. That's a good thing. Preventing bullying is always great. Um, the policy has more information about what we collect from your activities and our partners, how we connect information across the Facebook companies and personalize your experience, including ads. Now I'm questioning that part about including ads. Now, ads could be, um, I'm just gonna be, I'm just gonna think of it this way. Like if somebody saw something like a picture and they said, I wanna use your picture for an ad, that could be very um, good for you if, you know, they contact you. Um, they went to Instagram, want to contact you, which I probably won't do. They probably just go straight to you. And they want to let you make some money off the of ad because I believe everything could be financial gain, you know, if it's presented the right way. And the little video stuff like that. Um, once again, I'm speculating, I'm not really sure. But they were saying they won't sell your data, they won't sell and stuff like that. But. <clears throat> Like I said before, I'm doing this video because if you have anything you could share, what they mean by this on Instagram, that use your data or your video, stuff like that, they said, won't be doing that. They won't be selling your stuff. Um, new terms. They're trying to prevent bullying. And it's a lot, seem like it's going on behind the scenes. It seems like it's a lot going on behind the scenes. And I'm not really sure what it is. So I'm doing this video. So if you have any feedback, Please let it me know. And I'd like to know, what do you feel about this Instagram thing? How do you feel about it? Anyway, I'll be looking for the comments. And like anyone else that can share, please share. And like I said before, your story cover, email me at ravenoveryall.com. And I'll let y'all love you. And thank you for watching. Kiss the rain.